Antonio Brown. We haven't even got to talk about it yet. The wizard strikes again. Antonio Brown released by the Raiders. This was, what, Saturday morning as I opened my eyes? Yeah, Saturday was pure insanity if you were on Twitter. By 1 p.m. Pacific, he had signed a one-year contract with the New England Patriots. The deal's worth up to $15 million. Found out this morning he has a 2020 fully guaranteed $20 million option. So if things go according to planned, he will make $20 million next year as a member of the New England Patriots. Yes. So all the, all the people are like, ah, well, he lost $30 million. He found could, it. He could make 15 this year and 20 next year, and that's in two years. Yeah, yeah. So fantasy-wise, everyone wants to know, yeah. how do you look at the situation? Uh, the way that I – first of all, you watched New England dismantle the Pittsburgh Steelers last night without Antonio Brown, the best receiver in football over the last seven, eight years. Now they – get Antonio Brown. They get to add him to a team that saw... I mean, you had production out of Philip Dorsett last night, two touchdowns. You had massive production out of Rex Burkhead last night. Who looked great. Looked great. Currently healthy, apparently. And then Josh Gordon. Big game. Julian Edelman runs the yeah. same route on every play. He does. <laughs> how, I do, how do they not know what's coming? The, it reminds me... Uh, shout out to Al Smiz on this one because he, he posted, you know, why is he open on every play? He runs the same route every play. It reminds me of Wes Welker. I mean, yeah. you just run the same route every single play. For some reason, throws the invisibility cloak over. Uh, cut left, cut right, <laughs> wide open. <laughs> because you're watching one. Oh, he's done it to me six times in a row. There's no way he's going to do it again. Yeah, he's going to mix it up here. No, he's just going to, you know, break open, catch the ball. And then he'll make a first down sign with his hand, and then we'll proceed down the field. And because people were asking for it all weekend on Twitter, I will acquiesce. Oakland Raiders. Stop helping the Patriots. They don't need your help. Uh, you feel good? Feel good about I that? I feel a little bit better. Did you hear what Big Ben had to say about Antonio Brown going to the Patriots? I did not. What did he say? He went with a very adolescent whatever. That, let me translate that for our listeners. That means I'm furious. What on earth are they doing? So, fantasy-wise, I, I think it hurts Edelman. I think it hurts Gordon. I think it hurts uh, both these players because you cannot bring in a guy like Antonio Brown who will demand 10 to 12 targets a game and not hurt the other players' ceilings. That doesn't mean that they can't coexist. If you played Edelman, Gordon, Philip Dorsett last night, you were, right. you were dancing in the streets. Yep. But I think it hurts both players. You know, a player like Josh Gordon, I'll, I'll bring this up because we were talking about this before the show. Josh Gordon does not live on volume. He lives on on uh, big, big plays. plays. Yeah. Because he's he's an 18-plus per catch player, touchdowns, big plays. There's an argument that can be made that those aren't really – he's not going to get fewer opportunities on deep balls and things like that, and his volatility is probably similar. But you said you thought Edelman's going to be fine, too. So yeah. are we making too much about nothing with Antonio Brown? Uh, I, I think the biggest hit for uh, the Patriots stock, it's Josh Gordon. And it'll be interesting to see what happens to James White when you have Wes Welker and – I'm sorry, uh, Julian Edelman and Antonio Brown who can both eat up the middle of the field. I went back and looked just to make sure, you know, I, I wasn't remembering things from crazy land, but – when Randy Moss was dominating on the Patriots, Wes Welker, who Julian Edelman plays that role, was perfectly fine. The year that Randy Moss had 23 touchdowns, Wes Welker, 112 receptions, 1,175 yards. The next year, they both – like, Can they, I counterpoint that, though? Sure. Can I bring a different perspective? Randy Moss did not have Josh Gordon on the other side of the field. Yeah, that's Josh Gordon is definitely – And they aren't going to throw the ball as much as that team. They might. <laughs> I don't think so. Well, I certainly don't think the production will be the same as last night. They didn't rush in a touchdown. They they have these games. This happens a lot. Brady can go from four touchdowns to one, and Sonny Michelle or Rex Burkett could have two, three touchdowns on the ground. Yeah, so I'm, I'm not arguing with the fact when you bring in the best wide receiver in football, of course it has a negative impact 
volume wise, but I just I think of the guys that Wes Welker is. Or I keep doing it, man. Well, I brought him up. It's yeah. my fault. You've infected me. That it's Julian my fault. Edelman. I can't expect you to be accurate. Julian Edelman will be. He's still going to be super safe. Yeah, I. Yeah, I, I. I'm telling you, he will be very, very safe. As what? As what you drafted him to do. Hmm. Last night, six for eighty-three, no touchdowns. Yeah, that's a great game. That, like that's what you drafted at Julian Edelman to do with the upside of a touchdown, but more than five receptions. He, he's a he's a PPR guy. They get Ben Watson back in Week Five. Gronk will probably wind up I, undefeated season. <laughs> Patriots. Antonio Brown, though, I view this as a better efficiency situation, lower volume situation than what he would have had in Oakland. I don't think the targets are going to be what they would have been in Oakland. Agreed. But I, you know. You're with the better quarterback on a better offense, so I don't really view him any different than where I would have ranked him draft season-wise with Oakland. Do you agree with that? Yep. Okay. Thank you so much for watching that video. It would make me so happy if you watched more of those videos. So click subscribe, ring that bell, and make your life a little better today.